Hello again, human beings from the planet Earth. We are on a cross-country ski trail that if we are to continue in this direction, we will hit Kearsarge uh, Street, Kearsarge Road, Intervale Crossroad area. You locals know where it is. Uh, the other end of this back this way is right next to the property of the Intervale Motel. Uh, and I'm pretty concerned. I've been coming out here for over a week now, a couple weeks now. Uh, because the teenagers in the area are coming out here and cigarettes and pot again. Um, and there's many kids involved in this. I, I have not seen any signs of alcohol, so kudos to the kids for staying away from that at least. Uh, and we've done some effort to clean up because they're just trash in this place. You can see trash everywhere. Uh, my guys took about uh, two full black trash bags full of shit out of here already and probably after the rains we'll come back and clean this up but it's not only uh, you know what's being done out here by these teens that concerns me it's the fact that we have a mother bear and cubs that lives in this area uh, there's plenty of berries you can see bear poop and this same bear uh, broke the steel weld on the lock to the dumpster the other night <clears throat> she's in this area and if you think I'm a big jerk when my kids uh, are in danger, you can imagine what a mother bear might be like should her cubs wander up on you. Now these kids sit just down here, down this trail. I'm gonna show you and then I'm gonna bring you back. And if you're a parent in here, I'm gonna recommend that you keep a little shorter lease on your kids or at least inform them because when there's a group of five kids here and a mother bear goes on a rampage, at least one of them is going to die. Okay, at least one of them is going to die. That's just end of discussion. Uh, there'll be a miracle if any of them get out unscathed. So they sit right here, they hang out. Uh, and this was horrible a week ago. Somebody's been back here. Uh, and so you know, I have confiscated five packs of cigarettes, a couple pouches of tobacco, and two glass pipes from this little hangout here over the last week. So kids, thank you because I didn't have to buy any cigarettes this week and um, that's awesome. So good for you. Uh, no, really, you guys don't know how much danger you're in out here. Now, remember we're only the distance of uh, 50 feet. Well, maybe it's 70 feet, 60, somewhere thereabouts. But Right here inside of this hill, I'm going to take you to the opening now. And uh, obviously, bears aren't hibernating right now, but this does confirm that these bears are in this area. This is their home, and you kids are playing in it. Okay, you see the size of that hole? There is no ground animal that makes a hole that big. That is, in my opinion, a bear den. And I, I'm sure of it. I, I mean, it only makes sense that it is. Um, and either way, even if I'm wrong about that being a den, I do know that there is a mother bear with at least two cubs in this area. So kids, big heads up. I love you guys. Uh, and I am watching. And like I told a few of you earlier today when I came out here, if you're under 18 and I catch you on video, and I will, it's going to your parents. If you're over 18 and there are children around you, it's going to the law. Everybody else, much love, many thanks, and I will see you soon.